For years, the region has heard of all the advantages of building a new bridge across the Ohio River. Every day, the terrifyingly unsafe and deadly Brent Spence Bridge threatens the 200,000 people who cross it. The bridge's congestion is not simple nuisance. Every year, it robs us of hundreds of millions of dollars in wasted fuel and time. Every moment, the world marketplace weighs that danger and that congestion, and commerce is encouraged to move to other regions. So we know well what a new bridge would bring to the region. But what would happen if we do not build a new bridge? What happens is that our roadway network collapses into complete gridlock. The video forecasts traffic volume between 2005 and 2040 during the morning rush hour. It illustrates what happens to traffic if we don't build a new bridge. The red line represents gridlock, and the thicker the red line, the longer you are in gridlock. As the red line grows and grows through the years, the regional impact of not building the Brent Spence Bridge becomes debilitating. By 2025, the entire road network is affected by gridlock. By 2040, nothing is moving on our roads. Let's look at specific parts of the regions and see what we can expect if we do not build a new bridge. Travel time on Interstate 71 between Kings Island and the downtown Cincinnati Business District swells from 37 minutes in 2005 to 137 minutes in 2040 an increase of more than an hour and a half for that 23-mile trip. The trip between Claremont County to the Cincinnati Central Business District on Interstates 275 and 471 grows by more than one hour. It will take over an hour and a half to drive the 12 miles from Florence, Kentucky to the Central Business District in Cincinnati. And travel time from one of the region's most important assets, the Northern Kentucky Greater Cincinnati Airport to the Cincinnati Business District increases from 30 minutes to 104 minutes for this 13-mile trip. So, this is our future if we do not build a new bridge. Every year we wait, it not only adds hundreds of millions of dollars to the cost of the new bridge, it guarantees the region will choke on its own congestion. What businesses will want to locate here? How many of our children will want to stay here when grown? How much will our wages be lowered by an economy that literally cannot move? The real message is we must get going. If we wait, we lose. We lose to those regions that are building infrastructure to meet the challenges of a global economy. So let's get to work. Let's win our future. Let's build our new bridge now.